If you've ever had to care for an ill grandparent or maybe someone who's recovered from surgery, you know how expensive medical equipment can be. For 28 years, Care Chest of Sierra Nevada has been providing everything from wheelchairs to diabetic supplies to those who have no insurance or who are underinsured, all free of charge. Andy Guevara shows us how Care Chest makes it possible and how we all can help. <clears throat> Small but mighty. Care Chest of Sierra Nevada's warehouse in Golden Valley isn't oversized, but the organization serves a large population. We have about 15,000 people a year come through our doors. One of those people was Miguel Villarreal. He first arrived 10 years ago after getting diagnosed with diabetes. He gets emotional remembering it. I wouldn't be sitting here talking to you right now if it wouldn't have been for this organization. Care Chest provided Miguel with test strips, insulin, and syringes for years at no cost to him. For some, it's durable equipment like crutches or a wheelchair. For some, wellness classes. The variety of services offered is impressive. For independent living, we also have a cash loan program where people can borrow money from us at a low interest rate to make changes to their homes so that they can stay at home instead of in a facility. One of the ways Care Chest is able to provide these critical resources is with a popular fundraiser. Bacon, Bourbon and Brews, held this past weekend in Reno, brought about 500 people to Wingfield Park and raised tens of thousands of dollars. We provide about $1.3 million a year of services and it, we are here entirely because of the donating public. And if you want to help, but can't donate cash, the group gratefully accepts gently used medical equipment that they sanitize and repurpose, or donate time as a volunteer. For Miguel, it's the right thing to do. They help me, I help them. Covering the story, Andy Guevara, Channel 2 News. Care Chest is now serving double the amount of clients that they were just three years ago, and they're always looking for ways to raise awareness.